What's going on, guys? My name is Will. Otherwise known as Brzeep, and otherwise known as Brzeep. For people that can't read my name correctly, quickly I just want to go over what I'm using in this free for all gameplay on driving. I'm using the AUG extended mags, and I forget what my secondary is honestly. So, um, but I'm using claymores, and I'm using flak jacket. Second, sorry, second chance. <laughs> Sleight of hand and tactical mask. I think I uh, probably should have been using ninja, but I was using tactical mask for some odd reason. In this video, I want to talk about some of the good things that are in the Black Ops multiplayer, and that should be carried over into the Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer. The first thing that I thought was good in Black Ops was that the noob tubes weren't as effective, and partially this is because the first perk tier, the first tier perk, sorry, <laughs> uh, flak jacket was really popular. I use it on all my classes personally, and that the noob tube didn't deal as much damage. Now I rarely get killed by any explosives in Black Ops. Uh, sometimes, like, basically, like, RCXD cards can't kill me, Claymores rarely kill me, Noob Tube pretty much never kill me. The Noob Tube is pretty, pretty rare, honestly, in Black Ops, and I like that because they made it, they made, I like how they kept it in the game still, but they made it so it wasn't as effective, and it still can be effective if you use it the right way, but really, you can't use that as your only, only gun you use in your, in the match. You can't just go around shooting the Noob Tube everybody, you have to actually shoot them, because the Noob Tube... Well, most likely get a hit marker and then they'll kill you when you're reloading. Uh, second thing on my list is the non stackable kill streaks. Now, I really like this because getting a nuke in Model for 2 was honestly way too easy. All you really needed was a 7 kill streak, and you, were, you, you, you pretty much were on your way to a nuke. Unless the team was smart and shut down your chopper gunner like, immediately. And most of the time, that it was impossible because of the spawns in Model for 2. Um, but I'm not saying what kill streaks in Black Ops are really good because if you get dogs, you actually get 11 kills with your gun, and I like that because I I really I hated how <laughs> people would get people would be like oh my god I got a nuke and I'd be like okay congratulations you had a seven kill streak. So yeah, one really good thing in Black Ops, and I hope they carry that into my own for three. Uh, third thing on my list is the second chance uh, update in Black Ops, and update was. If you put the guy, if you shot someone into last stand and someone else on your team finished the guy off, the person that put him into last stand would get the kill, and then the guy that finished him off would get the assist. I like this once again because they didn't. I don't. I quite quite honestly, I don't understand why they can't just take the perk out. I wish they could just take the perk out of the game. I don't really understand why they can't take the perk out of the game. It seems it seems simple. Like just take the perk out of the game, and no one no one will complain. I don't. I I don't know people that would complain about second chance being removed from the game. I would rejoice, and <laughs> probably everybody else would. But I sorry about the lag right here. Um, to interrupt myself. I don't really know what happened with the inner mode, but whatever. Um. Oh, and one more thing. I'm using non-lethal kill streaks in this game. Three, four, f three, four, eight. So UAV, counter UAV, and Blackbird. He's a really good kill streak, guys. Um, because I, I pretty much in the entire game, I have a UAV or a counter UAV or a Blackbird in the air. Um, and it's really good because getting a three kill streak in this game, it's pretty easy. I mean, if if you're if you're good, I mean, doesn't you don't have to be good to get a UAV. I mean, three kill streak is really easy, and knowing where the enemies are is a huge advantage. Obviously, you get the jump on them, and it's just that much easier to kill people. And right here, I couldn't even figure out where this guy was because I just I was playing. This is like one of the first matches I played in this map. <laughs> I was kind of confused, and then I come up here and finally figure out where he was, and I killed him. And then I see this guy on the radar. He's gonna come upstairs. I turn around and I shoot him, and he nice me. And I hate that because I use tactical, and most people probably use de default. So I mean, the first thing to do is knife. The first thing I do is shoot. So it happens a lot to me, but I'd rather be able to crouch and pr prone uh, faster than knife faster, honestly. But back on topic, um, what was I still was I still on the second chance pr topic? Um, whatever. Um, second chance. Yeah, like I said before, really good. How they? I mean, I wish I just take it out of the game. I already said this before, <laughs> but they, I mean, they did the best that they could without taking it out of the game, and they made it so if I put the guy in a second chance, I get the kill, no matter what. I like that. I hope they put that in the model for three. Fourth thing on the list is that the all, you can only use pistols at your secondary in Black Ops, and I like that because I felt that it was overpowered to have a really good assault rifle that had no recoil in model for two, and to have a Spas 12 or a Kimbo 1887s. Which is kind of ridiculous, <laughs> and I, I don't know. I just I just I thought it was 
too easy. I mean, in COD 4, you you the pr your primary could be a shotgun, and in Black Ops, your primary can be a shotgun. And I don't know. I don't know why they changed that, honestly. Um, but I I I like that they made it only pistols in Black Ops. And another thing is one little thing is that marathon. Uh, the the regular marathon perk in Black Ops doesn't give you unlimited sprint. It gives you longer sprint, but the pro version gives you unlimited sprint. And I like that because it makes you work for your unlimited sprint. I f it gets a bit un it gets unrealistic, obviously, to sprint for as long as you can. But I mean, it makes it a little bit more realistic. I like how they make you work for your unlimited sprint. Um, also, I like how I like all the custom customization in. Black Ops. That's a really, really good thing about Black Ops. And I love that I can customize my red dot, my red dot, or my what is it? I, my red dot site. I'll just say that <laughs> my ACOG site. I think they have. You can you can uh, play with that too. I don't play Black Ops that much, guys, at all. This is like I haven't played Black Ops in months, honestly. Like I played three games in the new map pack on multiplayer. That's pretty much it. But I like that you can customize your camo. You can customize. Your, uh, I mean, you, you can still customize your camera model too, but I mean, you can customize your red dot sites, your color and the shape of the red dot site, and you can put emblems and uh, your clan tag on your gun, which is really cool. Like you can see, I have the, I made a sleight of hand, uh, the perk sleight of hand on my gun. It looks kind of cool. Um, and then you can also, what else can you customize? Oh, your. Uh, your face paint, like you can put face paint on your guy. So I mean, really cool. It just I like how you can customize your player. It's just a really neat addition to the game. And um, I don't expect that to be in Marvel 3. Honestly, I don't, I don't really think it will. But I'd be fine. I mean, it'd be cool if it was. And one thing I wanted to address before this game's over, real quick, is uh, the X, not the XP, the uh, COD points in Black Ops. Now I don't, I didn't enjoy it, the the points in Black Ops because. I thought it was uh, I, I, it was more rewarding to get my 250 headshots with my intervention to get fall count, but in Black Ops I can just buy it. So the game's over, guys. I, I think I went 30 and six or something. I got two black birds. So it was a good game. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment. I appreciate it. Thanks, guys.